What is up, Gorilla Pack? Today, we're going to eat 10,000 calories of chicken nuggets from McDonald's. At least we're gonna try to. Cheers. I am actually very confident in us this time because we do not have a timer. I'm starving. We just gotta pace ourselves. We didn't eat breakfast, we didn't eat lunch. This is our only meal for the whole day. Or for the week. Can I get some barbecue sauce though? Oh my God. Thank you, thank you sauce master. <laughs> this is gonna help us a lot. You can make the nuggets slide down, you know? Who has the best nuggets? Ooh, you can't go wrong with McNuggets though. McNuggets are freaking good, dude. These are, these are S tier for sure. Mm -hmm. I will say Wendy's do have a nice nugget. Mm, Wendy's nuggets are good, mm -hmm. yeah. You know who has good nuggets that no one ever talks about? Carlos Jr. I like the Star Nuggets, right? Yeah, yeah. Those mm -hmm. are pretty good, dude. Okay, good. And you, you like the Star Nuggets for Carlos Jr.? They're okay. Really? What's your favorite nugget? I do like the Spicy Nuggets from Wendy's. Bomb. Mm -hmm. But my go-to McDonald's. And you can't go wrong with these. And just so you guys know, there are nuggets under here. Uh -huh. Like you can clearly see that was like a pile of nuggets. We did the math, 10,000 calories right here. We had a pretty big bill. I mean, chicken McNuggets aren't that expensive. So but like they're, the they're, fact- They're almost like a dollar each, no? I like think, one nugget is a dollar? I, I, no. I, I, current inflation deal? Because it was 40 pieces. It was 12 bucks for 40 piece. I'm not good at math. I need like 25 cents a nugget, right Angel? I failed math three times, bro. McDonald's used to be cheaper though. Freaking inflation cranked up the prices of everything. You should get a cheeseburger for like what, 59 cents? Mm hmm. Now you can't go to McDonald's and you have to spend like minimum like 10, 15 bucks. 15 bucks for one person mm -hmm. fast food is not crazy. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. They have like these $5 deals now. $5 deals for McDonald's? They brought it back? You know what they gotta bring back? The $5 foot longs. $5 foot longs. That's when society peaked. <laughs> when we had $5 foot longs. Subway's like eight bucks minimum now. If that's for like just bread and uh -huh. some ham. If you want some vegetables, it's gonna cost you 18 mm -hmm. plus tax. Ramon's a Subway connoisseur. I love Subway. Yeah. Unhealthy obsession with Subway. Cause I honestly don't even think it's good. It, I, you make your sandwich, what do you mean? You just don't know how to choose one. Unpopular opinion, I do not like sandwiches. You don't. I just feel like sandwiches as a whole in society are the most boring food ever. I just feel like there's way better options than sandwiches and I will die on that hill. You probably had a, a lot of sandwiches when you were younger and you're just over them. Yeah, I got like some trauma. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, what the hell, this one's big. What's your guys' go-to dipping sauce? Buffalo. Yeah, I like buffalo. buffalo. Yeah, buffalo sauce tastes good with everything. I yeah. will say, not sponsored, but McDonald's, buff McDonald's buffalo, bomb. I like the creaminess. I can't talk. Yo, McDonald's needs to sponsor us. We need to get sponsored by some type of fast food because we give them so much free publicity. Anyone. Please, anybody. Fast food people, <laughs> I'm begging you, just just throw us a bone. Please. How many nuggets do you think you ate already? 10, easy. 10? That's it? Uh, we just started. <laughs> I feel like I already ate like 15 or 20. Maybe no. I'm exaggerating. You're exaggerating for sure. <laughs> you lied no. to yourself. No, I swear, bro. Mm. It feels like I ate because I feel like I had like, like a whole pile here, and then now it's like kind of like gone. I feel like I'm around 10, like tw at least 12. Your pile looks bigger than mine. <laughs> I'm reaching from yours. The strategy for this? Just freaking <laughs> eat. Do you know how many subscribers we have on Gorilla Pack now? 80? Almost 81,000. Oh. You better watch out, Angel. Angel. It is currently, when we're filming this, July 19th, y'all. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Which means we have, what, three more months of summer? Two more summer months? Summer just started. Yes, yeah, yeah, like two and a half more months of summer until we win our bet. Because Angel doesn't think we can hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of summer. Mm -hmm. Angel's our biggest hater. So subscribe if you hate Angel. Yeah, <laughs> we're trying to prove him wrong, guys. So please hit that subscribe button. Cause I don't know why he doubted us to begin with, but he did, and we're gonna prove him wrong. Mm -hmm. We're gonna show him a lesson. What do I win if you guys don't? We're gonna win. Yeah, we don't even need to worry about that because you're not gonna win. Mathematically, it's impossible for us to lose. We have the gorilla pack behind us, mm -hmm. and they're gonna click the subscribe button and prove you wrong. Mm -hmm. Right, guys? Right? I think I completed one sauce so far. Yeah, me too. You think we're wasting calories on the sauce though? But it's because these are dry though. Yeah, they're pretty these, dry. These are, these are dry. Hey, oh, fun fact guys, when we ordered this, apparently they have a limit on how many <laughs> chicken McNuggets you can order through their app. Because <laughs> we tried to order them all through the app and the app would not let us. So we had to do two separate orders. If you ever want to order over 200 nuggets, you cannot order it through the app or nope. you have to do two separate orders. Learn from us, be better than us. This would hit at a party though. If you pull up to any party with 200 nuggets, you're the talk of the town for like the next decade.
decade. I like the fact that we don't, we're not tired this time because I feel like it just takes the pressure off and then we can take a break, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. keep it going, take a break, keep it going. It gives us time to breathe. Yeah, you know? I could hear you breathing, Ramon. Well, I'm always breathing heavy, bro. <laughs> a high key Ramon is always breathing heavy. What, what were we doing when you're like breathing super heavy? <laughs> just walking? Like, yeah. I'm fat. <laughs> I mean, look what we're doing right now, bro. I just had a fast metabolism. I'm just lucky. I'm just fat. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Thanks to my body, we're gonna finish this. We still got a lot to eat, I gonna lie. It's kind of overwhelming. Angel, are you gonna help us if we get stuck? No, I just had lunch. Bro, come on, dude. You know you want some though. You know you, know, you, know you want some. Uh, I'll take a 40 piece. Oh no, uh, I got sauce on me. No. L in the chat. <laughs> I'm choking on a nugget. Cause we're not done filming, we're filming more videos. So after this video that we're filming, we're gonna film us playing Roblox. So that should be fun. You guys ever played Roblox? We played it one time, like briefly. Like we, yeah. I don't, Just to check it out. I don't understand this though. <laughs> I don't know like, it's what like it is. A, it's a game within a game within a game. There's a million games within one game. Yeah. And there's a thousand of those. Yeah. I, I don't know what's going no on. No story. No. No story is just like you go into Roblox and Roblox is like figure it out. Yeah, yeah, pretty it's much. Like, yeah. It's, like, no it out. yeah. It's like it's like the real world, honestly. Like no one well, shows no one teaches you about the real world. Roblox yeah, is true. life. That's a good point, yeah. All I know is that the kids love Roblox. I don't think you can find one kid in the United States that has not played Roblox. That is true. Hey. Can Does that do count it? as juggling if it's only two? I count it. <laughs> you saw how Wemby? Yo, Wemby is crazy, bro. He's, he's doing some stunts. For those oh. who don't know, Wemby is like this crazy. Um, no. This is his second year in the best in the NBA, but he's this crazy tall NBA player, and he's insane. He's like, like seven foot four. I think he's like seven foot five or something, bro. He's like he's built different. That's all I know. He's mm. built like an alien. He's the future of the NBA. Buy your stock now. Who you got winning the NBA championship as of right now? As of right now? Who's favorite? July, in July of 2024? Mm-hmm. I'm thinking Denver, bro. I feel like they do, they do need a big, a big, another big, a decent oh, big, a big. Have you seen the Lakers uh, new guy? Oh, the- Dalton Connect? Uh, bro, he's nice. I haven't seen any footage. Really? Oh, he's been popping off in the summer okay, league. Okay. How loud is Staples gonna be when Bronny and LeBron play together? That'll be crazy, dude. That'd be insane. Angel, how many minutes are we in? I have no idea. I was not keeping track. That's about yeah, halfway there. Yeah, I feel like it's half. By the way, guys, Angel, he's currently working on a top secret project for us. We'll throw it up on screen real quick just so you guys can see. Boop. He's popping off right oh, now. He's... All I gotta say is stay tuned because when we're done with this, it's game over. Mm -hmm. It's game over. I think you guys are gonna like it. Let's just say Angel's the GOAT when it comes to props. Yeah. Angel is building our own Disneyland. That's all I gotta say, right, Angel? Angel is built different. Even though he's our biggest hater, he's pretty nice when it comes to props, all right? He's not that bad. <laughs> Whew, okay, we, we, we get in there, we get in there. Nah, nah, me fool, dude, that's cool, yeah. I think I just gotta slow my pace down a little more, you know, I gotta s move the nuggets in my stomach mm -hmm. so they fit. Yeah, yeah. Whew, mm -hmm. if you really think about it, this is the dream. People literally dream about this. I, this has been my dream since I was two. These mukbangs are probably one of the hardest videos we do. <laughs> they, they just really because are. like it's physically hard, mm -hmm. not because like mentally hard or anything, it's just hard to eat a lot of food. I eat a lot. I don't really eat like this. It is tough, but if someone's gonna do it, why not us? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. What do you call this nugget, Angel? I believe that is the boot. It looks like Kentucky. Mm -hmm. You're... <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> There's four different shapes of nuggets. What are the four shapes? There's the boot. All right, the boot, that's the boot for sure. There's the ball. The ball, okay, that's the ball. There's a bell. Is it the normal nugget kind? No, that's the bone. Is it the bone? There's a bone and a bell. This one has to be, is this one the bell? I oh, believe that's this, the, this bell. the bell. Dang, Angel knows all the McDonald's lore. <laughs> I know, what the heck? <laughs> mm. What makes these nuggets good? Like The outside. The crispiness? I think the taste is on the outside. Mm. That is a good crispy, you know? Let's start separating it. And you get your side. All right, so you <sighs> knock that out. I'll knock this out. Jesus Christ, all right. <sighs> How many more is this? How many have we ate? I feel like I'm 30-ish, maybe? 40? There's no way, I had to eat at least 40. I think we're close to 40, yeah. I might be exaggerating, but I feel like <laughs> I had, you had eight? Yeah. You've only had eight of them? Well, Angel, you gonna help us or what, bro? I might. Angel, I need your help. I'll help you if you can answer this question. All right. 
Where was the first McDonald's located? San Bernardino, California. Easy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's the one good thing that has come out of our city. The one good the thing. The one. Nothing else one. good has come out of our city. Nothing else. The only thing of decency. Yeah. To come out of San Bernardino. It's McDonald's. The world's largest fast food brand came from our city. Like that's insane. That's why I'm fat. You know, like it's so inspirational. All right, <laughs> throw, throw me a nugget. Oh, he caught it. Barely. That's your throw. All right, Angel helped us with one nugget. Can I, can I throw you like 20 more now? No. Every two minutes, we're gonna throw you a nugget. No. Oh, you're hitting the wall. Or what? <laughs> yeah, I'm getting a little full now. Not gonna lie. Me too. <sighs> I think we just gotta breathe a little bit, you know? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We gotta let it like sit in our yeah. stomachs a bit, you know? Yeah, you know? Yeah. What would Joey Chestnuts do? Dude, Joey Chestnut would devour this in like one minute. Yeah. He'll be really disappointed in me. Or I don't Matt, know how Matt to do Stoney, it. Matt Stoney, dude, oh, Matt Stoney, bro. bro. Eric the Electric, are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> These guys are goats. I'm you, just fat. You know what we have to do? We have to do what the professional food eaters do. They like dip water. it. Yeah, they dip it in water and then they make it like mm. soggy. But then that's like, they don't do it for the taste. That's oh, what no. they're just doing it to, just I'm, to finish it out. I'm trying to enjoy these. I feel like the sauce helps you guys. It does. No, I will say it does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes it moist. Makes it moist because it's pretty dry. Yeah, they are. You ever heard that story of that lady that sued McDonald's because of her coffee? Oh, well, she burned herself, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And she won? She did. She won like a lot of money too. I don't know how much it was, but it was a lot of money. You know what's funny? I read about it. And so like everyone like hates on that lady, right? Uh-huh. Because they're like, oh, like it's your fault. Like it's hot coffee. Obviously it's common it's sense, right? Yeah, right? Yeah. But really what it was, was apparently, I don't know if this is true, but online they said that apparently like McDonald's or some PR people, they were just like pumping out PR to make her look bad. Mm, okay. So what, what really happened was I guess allegedly, 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 McDonald's was serving extremely scolding hot coffee that it shouldn't have been that hot. Yeah. Allegedly. Allegedly. She won 200,000. What? That's it. I thought it was way more than that. Why is everyone why was everyone mad about that? <laughs> That's not even that much. I was thinking it was like millions of millions. Yeah, looking like six million dollars. But anyway, so she was actually a victim. Oh, 2.7 million. Oh, there okay. we go. That's That's, that sounds better. That sounds more right. But yeah, so she was actually like a victim no, and yeah, then yeah. like it burnt her skin off. Yeah, I mean, and she had to get like surgery or something. I don't know, but whether it's true or not, I don't know. I don't know. Allegedly. Allegedly, right? Hey, but was it 2.4 million? Don't sue me, McDonald's. <laughs> I feel like growing up, like one million dollars was like the dream. Like if you get a million dollars, like you're set for life. That's but, what it did feel like. Yeah, but nowadays, a million dollars, man, I feel like that's not gonna set you up for life it's at like all. It's like a hundred bucks? Yeah, it's like, I mean, it's not a hundred bucks. It's still a lot of money, but. A, I'll, I'll take a million. It just doesn't hit the same no. as when we were kids, huh? Mm -hmm. Add inflation to the mix. Uh huh. Gas prices. Fee bucks. I was really good at Fortnite, dude. I feel like I was pretty good at, at Fortnite. Not, not good enough to like compete. But like, I, I have some nice aim, okay? You will hold your own. The problem was when these kids grew up and they got freaking crazy on the- Cranking, cranking the 90s, or yeah. 90s? I don't yeah. even know. The, the kids got too good and I'm too old that I can't keep up with no, the kids. We got they, jobs, dude. Yeah, we have jobs. <laughs> the kids just stay at home all day playing. <laughs> like that's their job. Take me back to Tomato Town. I'm pretty sure like all the places that we used to go to don't exist anymore. The map, the old map. That's like real life. <laughs> it's all sad. Twin Towers? No, no, no. The Twin Towers? No. <laughs> I know it's not that. I know it's not that. Uh, uh, what is it called? What was it called? Tilt, Something. Tilted Tilt Tilt Towers. Towers. Tilted Towers. Was, My bad. Hey, good. have you been to uh, Disneyland recently, Angel? I just went two days ago. Two days ago? I just went to go eat, have some <laughs> dinner, and then I went home. That's tight. That's Angel's favorite place is Disneyland. Disneyland is pretty freaking awesome, bro. There used to be McDonald's at Disneyland. Well, they, yeah. just, they just want to sell like their own stuff, huh? Dude, Disneyland food sucks. I say that again. That, Disneyland why. food sucks. Everything oh, yeah. about Disneyland is awesome, except their food. Their food sucks. It's kind Do you of agree, agree or disagree, Angel? Disagree. Disagree, why? You're eating at the wrong places. Dude, I swear, I've eaten at so many different places. Every single place I've eaten at, it's all mid. All of it. It is pretty mid. Look, look, camera on me. I've been to Disney like once or twice. Food's mid, bro. I've been, I don't know how many times. I've been over like 15 times at least. That's pretty good. And I have yet to have a food there where I'm like, yo, this is bomb. It's nah. just glorified cafeteria food. I That's said it. That's what it is. I said it. I feel like, they, they, go, they gotta feed millions of people. Like they're not gonna like handcraft your meal. Yeah, but see, that's it should be because like their rides are dope, their sets are dope, everything about Disneyland is dope except their food. Maybe it's just the American Disneyland, you know? I've been seeing videos like Disney Tokyo. 
Oh, that's true. When I went that to food? Disney Tokyo, that food was good. Bum shit? They had some bum bows there. Ooh, that was good food. Maybe, maybe it's just like uh, an American thing. You're like, oh, like yeah. they're going to buy it anyways, you know? And they probably think that it's nasty over there. Maybe. That's true. <laughs> oh, yeah. that's, true yeah. that's true. Like, as a tourist, we're like, oh, it's better. So does that mean tourists think that Disney California food is good? Because mm. they would be wrong if they yeah. <laughs> think that. So Never. you think it's good, Angel? I wouldn't have gone just to eat if it wasn't. What'd you eat? I went to Frontierland. There's a Mexican spot there, and I had the burrito with a side of chips, and it had a side of esquite all mixed together. Very so good. good. It was delicious. On a scale one through 10. I gave it a high eight. A high eight? That good? Yeah, it's pretty good. So you literally w went there just for that? And I went shopping. That's crazy, bro. It's because he has a Disney pass, though. So. so like, he could go just for whatever. I'm just saying, I talk about a smack about like people with Disney passes, but that's because I'm jealous. I'm jealous. I wish I had a Disney. I pass. wish I had one too. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. I wish I was a. I could just go to Disney for dinner. I'm just a hater. I have never had an unpleasant experience at Disney. I mean, they call it the happiest place on earth. Yeah, except when I eat their food. <laughs> What's the best ride at Disney, Angel? I like Indiana Jones, but it always breaks the down. That's right. You think that's the best ride of all the rides? There's only one ride. One ride. Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Oh, that's that's a good one. That's a fun one. That, that, that one's fun, man. Remember when you told me about it? Yeah, yeah. I was excited. And then I went. Yeah. I was like, nah. Yeah. I was like, Anthony's probably just playing it up. No, it was fun, dude. It's fun. That one's fun. I like that one a lot. And I went into that one blind. I didn't see any videos, so I didn't even know what to expect. It like blew my mind. I was disappointed at first. I don't want to spoil it for anyone that's never been on it. But at the beginning of the ride, I was disappointed. But then it got crazy. And then I was like, whoa. I know what you're talking about. You, if you know, you know. If you don't know, you got to go check it out if you can. Use promo code uh, TCG. <laughs> if, it won't work. What about Knott's Berry Farm? You like Knott's Berry Farm? I used to go a lot. I do want to go back. I'm not going to lie. I just went last year. It's pretty fun. I like it. They got some fun rides over there. What's your favorite? The Supreme Scream was pretty fun. That's the one that goes up and down. Well, I'm not doing that one. It was freaking scary, though, but it is fun. I did it once. Like, I did do it. There was a time when I was younger Super scared of roller coasters. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't get on them. One day, I was like, my younger sister goes on these. I'm not gonna let her show me up. Uh -huh. So then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go on all the rides with her. And we did. So I went on that one, and I promised myself never never again. <laughs> Wait, have you been to Six Flags? I did. Dude, I haven't been to Six Flags in years. I just, I just been there once, ever. Really? I went on all the rides, except for like the one that goes up and down. That's the one that- oh, That's the one higher? Or? Yeah, it's way higher than the uh, Supreme Screen, dude. Oh, it's yeah. like twice as high. Oh, hey, and that no. was, to this date, has been the scariest roller coaster I've ever been on. I'm not, I would never that get on one's that. That one's freaking scary. I would never get on that. When I got up there, because it goes so <laughs> high. Did you see the curvature of the earth? Yeah, <laughs> no, literally, you probably do. You go all the way up, and then when I was up there, I was like, I, I, I never regretted anything more in my life. Like, I was legitimately scared. It was so freaking scary. That ride specifically is freaking scary. Ramon ranks all the roller coasters at Six Flags Magic Mountain. Ooh, that's a good video. You like roller coasters? I'm a, I'm a bit scared, but I'll do them. Universal, ooh. That's, that's, a, a, that's, that's, a, a, that's a park. I haven't been there in a while either. Shame. Is this the most chicken nuggets you guys bought? Yeah. Before from McDonald's? Heck yeah. yeah. I never bought this many nuggets in my life. Bro, this is a Tuesday. Bro, I buy two of these boxes and that's about it. That's true, yeah. We did some damage, bro. We definitely did some damage. Oh. Uh, I'm getting full though. Uh, I'm yeah, I'm I'm like Pink Floyd. I hit the wall, bro. Jesus. Oh my god, Angel. <laughs> How did that not spill? No, that's it? crazy. There's a nugget inside. Wow. The Look, sauce, and then added right on top. That's insane, dude. Why would you do that, Angel? <laughs> I think I would have been fired after that. No, yeah, you oh, would have yeah, for sure. For sure, bro. No doubt, me. no doubt. You're still fired, <laughs> regardless. But like, dang, I don't think that was lucky. Woo! Let me push this down. Let me adjust the nuggets. You know. What do you think? Can we finish? Uh, or we gonna throw up the white flag. <sighs> we still got some more in us. <sighs> Let me just catch up on my breathing. You know. What do you think, Angel? Did we have it? Not even a quarter. Do you think so? Really? Oh, yeah, we no, did damage, we, bro. We like half of it, bro. It looks about the same. No, you're <laughs> lying, dude. See, there he goes again. He's our hating. biggest, ha our hating. biggest hating. hater. Our biggest hater again. See? Our biggest hater. We're not lying, guys. He just hates. Angel, you don't want to, like, you know, like sub in for one of us? There you go. Woo! All right, that helps a bit. <laughs> See, we're doing that damage. Helps a bit. How many chickens does it take to make a 10 piece? Do you think this is a real chicken? It has to be part of a chicken. Oh, you know, I've seen it. Isn't it like pink? Um, yeah, it's like the, the pink goo. Yeah, is that is that real? I don't know if that was real or not. I, I saw it online. I want to say yes. I feel like that might have been fake. But like, you know, they got to mass produce these. Like, you know. But I also don't feel like this is like real chicken, probably. 
I, right. I think it's like bones, beak. It, yeah, like, it's probably like the leftover chicken. Yeah. I mean, obviously that's that's kind of what fast food is in general, <laughs> like leftover food. <laughs> How often do you eat out? I used to eat out way more for sure, but I recently, three. Three times a week? Yeah. I've, I've been doing better with like making my own yeah. food. I would say I'm probably the same way, like three times a week. Look, to cook something, you have to go to the store and buy what you're gonna cook. And then you gotta cook it. Then you have to prep it. Oh, you prep then, it. Then you have to prep it. And then you have to cook, and guess what? They, after you eat it, you have to clean. clean. And then no, guess what? You need more stuff from the store. Yeah, and then by the, time, by the time you clean, you're hungry again, so then you gotta do it all again. It's so, like an endless cycle. Just get 200 nuggets from McDonald's. I don't know if I can eat anymore, bro. I'm, I'm like, I hit a wall. We Angel, did damage, I don't care what Angel says. Angel, who do you think ate more? Me or Ramon, honestly? I think Ramon ate more. Really? Do you think or you know? Because I know I did. How many do you realistically think you ate? You At ate? least 40. <laughs> No? I don't think so. Really? I think- It felt like I ate 40. I feel like I did 40 for sure. All right, at least 30. Doug, who is our editor, he's gonna throw up how many we ate right here. It's like 18 and six. <laughs> uh, let us know in the comments down below what we should try next, what we should eat next, and we'll do our best yes, sir. to eat it. Hey, the great thing about this is now we have like lunch and dinner for the next oh, couple days.